Yo, what's up? Welcome back, everybody. It is your boy Liam's Ghost. I'm here with my boy Maddie Smokes, and uh, yeah, take an idea of what we're doing today. I'm talking to you, buddy. Oh, me? Yeah. Oh, I thought you were talking about them. I no. think we're gonna bait. Good guess. But on but on a real note, it's been pretty nice out lately. Buddy, just pissed all day. I was on a roof all day today, getting just showered. Well, I just pissed. woke up a couple hours ago, dodged all the rain. Yeah, no, no. Matt's been grinding lately. You watch any? I was up at six a.m. Man, I was up at six a.m. Started pissing for like five hours while I was on this roof. And then uh, I'll give you one of those for that. I'll give came, you a second. And then one. I came home. I had a bath, and then I got interrupted by you. Watch any good shows lately? I had to get a bath to get out all these freaking dirty shit under my nails, man. Freaking like. Yeah, it's rough, man. This is that's actual working class and shit. Like, <laughs> no, I don't have to just make videos and vape. And I thought stuff. you were unemployed. I mean, uh, yeah, I am unemployed. <laughs> what are you doing? A little side work? A little side hustle. Um, did I have I watched any good shows? Yeah. Game of Thrones. Whew. Started watching. You know, that. What you should watch what? Three Body Problem. Three Body Problem. It's a new show on Netflix. I got super baked last night and watched seven episodes of it. Was it good? If you're into that kind of sci-fi weird stuff, it's pretty weird. I like some sci-fi weird. I stuff. think you'd like it. Solid. I'm not going to spoil too much of it though, but you know what? Let's just get right into this video here. Now I have this little thing here. It's a oh. pod system. Oh, it's a beauty little pod system. Okay. It's very simple. Very simplistic. Why would you want something really simple? Why? Yeah. Let's say you're at a hockey game. Okay. You don't want to pull out this big old vape and you want to hit it in the stands. You know, you got to keep it low key. You got to keep it low key. Wrong. Oh, why? Because we're actually just... Testing out e-liquid today. Oh, so is this Mr. Keep it Fog? Well, I have to do this as well. <laughs> do you? Yeah. You don't have to. I want to. So today we're going to be checking out the brand new Mr. Fog e-liquid. A little bit of a slow roll, you know, starting this video off. But I thought it would be totally cool to talk about some TV shows. This guy throws out Game of Thrones. Like, everybody's seen that, buddy. Everyone that wants to see Game of Thrones has seen it, man. Well, put you people asked on. me people, if I see Put people on to something show. for once, man. I'm a simpleton, I'm going to put anybody on to nothing today. I'm a simpleton. When I ask women, problem, though? listen here, this is how I ask women if we should have sex. I go, should we? <laughs> I just go, should we? And they go, what? And I go, should we? And if they say yes, then it's on. One time I said to a girl, should we? And she said, should we what? I said, kiss. That's just say it didn't work. It, it, sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. Works for everybody else. And the thing is, is that somebody called me a Neanderthal because of the way I asked. And I went to, straight to the point. Should we yeah. or not? Like, I'm not going to bust my balls here, you know? Mr. Fog. So this one right here, this is the pop-up lemon. Pop-up lemon. Ooh. And you might think to yourself, dude, it probably takes so long to fill up so many different pods you already to try different up. juices. I took the liberty to fill them all up for you guys. But we still want to take a closer look at this. You filled up every single one individually? Yeah. I was just going to get like two vapes and just grab my yeah, favorites. Oh, yeah. Buddy, you know what the biggest problem was is what? once I filled them all up, it was like, okay, now how do I keep them all together? <laughs> what do you mean? You know what I mean? No, I don't. What do you mean? How do I keep them all together? Well, I thought I could just fit, squeeze it in the box, but there's no extra room in the oh, box. Oh, okay. So yeah, I see what you're doing. So I had to I do something a little did. strange, a little weird. I need to reach for your... But anyways, we got the... What is the first flavor we're going to be trying this here? This is... The Pop-Up Lemon, I believe. Pop-Up Lemon. Pop-Up Lemon by Mr. Fog E-Liquid. I've tried a lot of the Mr. Fog disposables, but I've never tried the e-liquid, so I'm super excited to give it Mr. a go. Mr. Fog is always gas. Facts. So I'm expecting Facts. the e-liquid to be honestly 10 times better than their disposables, because I wonder how long they sit in the disposables before you use them, you know? And guys, they sent me six different bottles. That's a lot of bottles. So I thought to myself, let me share it with a good buddy of mine, Maddie. Do you think we have the same flavors? Shared the enjoyment. Potentially. Probably not. Maybe could be we'll have to double check and see okay. but uh let's give the lemon a try let's give it uh, our first impressions so what are you gonna take title this oh dude that's a banger that's actually so good i like this smell you're dropping already. the lemon re lemon drop buddy that's better than lemon drop dead ass Kay. um i'm gonna be titling this uh my first time trying mr foggy liquid because it's my first time trying mr foggy liquid there you go. So, it keep it simple keep it what do they say? Keep it 55th Street. <laughs> now the sun's fucking beaming, man. I know, it's nice. The weather's been crazy lately. I was actually playing basketball and uh, soccer the other day. Uh, you know what I must say? Oh, this is, there was a very banger flavor, but it's very liquidy. 
I didn't fill she up moves. fill it yeah, up with too much good. liquid. I think it's good for it to be not too thick. That means that there's more. It's a more water based, hit, right? It's more throw water based, one? I think too. Because if it's too thick, the e liquid, you'll notice a lot of the time your coil burns out too easy. Or is it that? If, but that if it's I really think it's thin, the no, 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 no. Because if it's really it. thin, it's gonna fill the coil up. But it's also gonna, you can't overhead it if the liquid's thin. Makes I see sense, what you right? mean. Yeah. You know what I mean? Okay, the next one we're gonna be trying out. So that one is the pop up series. This one. We're gonna be moving it over to the Bubble Gang series here. We got the Bubble Gang Strawberry. Um, all of these are 30 mil bottles and they're 2% uh, nicotine strength, by the way. Um, 20 mg. I figure we might as well do another smell test. It also comes pre-wrapped in this nice little plastic here that I took the liberty of taking off earlier. Not make a fool of myself. I'm kind of excited. Give that a sniff. That's the strawberry, so bu strawberry Bubble Gang. Oh, shh. That smells real good. It smells so good, I just want to eat it. Should I just do a little? Actually, I don't know if you get eight or six. I already different. told this story before, but I'll tell it again after I take a hit of the Put bait because I don't want to be that guy. Lid. But, oh, sorry. Here you go. Oh, dude. Is that nuts? I just keep getting a little better and a little better. But I think I've told this story before, but I want to tell it again because it's super funny. Oh, back when I was like... Let's just say pretty young, okay? I was at the um, the P and E, which you know, if you're local, you definitely know about it. I was waiting on a line for this ride, and puffing on my little vapor, and there's this girl behind me, and she's like, Fuck. pokes me on the back, <laughs> and she's like, "Do you have any extra vape juice?" And I did. I had it in my hand. I was really just about to fill it up, and. But I was like, you know, I was down bad at the time. I didn't have very much money. So whenever I did get into money, you know, I had to get my priorities straight. Had to get some weed, had to get some vape juice, had to get fresh vape, that kind of thing. And I'm pretty sure I was pretty much spent at this point. And I had like this much left in the bottle. And it was a weird shaped bottle. It was like a really weird one. It didn't necessarily look like a bottle of vape juice. And I had it in my hand when I was like, no, I don't have any. And she's like, what's that then? And I was like, oh, this? It's candy. <laughs> And, and she was like, yeah, right, or tongue? something. And I fucking opened it up and took, like, a huge one, dude. Like, an actual huge fucking rip off it. I just squeezed, like, maybe three or four mils out and ate it just to really sell the bit. And she definitely didn't believe me or anything, but she was like, okay, he definitely doesn't want to give me any. And then I went on the ride afterwards. Absolutely terrible, bro. I, I can't believe I didn't puke. Do you think you maybe That's the most e -liquid spent I ever ate. more liquid than you would have just... Oh, yeah, I could have just filled it up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was just the principle. Looking You're back at it, looking back on it, it was a ter terrible idea. I don't know why I did that. I was kind of a prick move, to be honest, but it did happen. <laughs> You're just a man of principle. <laughs> it was something that happened. You stood. You stood your ground. Now, the next one is another pop-up flavor. This is going to be the grape. Sounds... The bar keeps going higher. I feel like it's going to level out here. Not always a big fan of the grapes. I gave that one a solid eight. That last you one was grape? fucking amazing. No, the last one I just tried. Oh, oh, okay, dude. One. This one smells like nasty grape, which this is a one really good grape. Smells exactly like grape high chew, which is the grape you want. I don't want like the real grape flavor. I you want high chew grape. I want like candy grape if yeah. I'm gonna get a grape. All right, let's. This give it was a go. so good. I would honestly, I'm probably gonna just try to steal this from you. I was going to say, yeah, you can have a couple bottles if you want. Give one to your mom. I think I might up. have the exact same Why not? Ones. Give that one a try. But I'm not sure. That one's so good. Uh, this is uh, great. Yeah. Cheers, everybody. Thanks Next. for tuning in for this long. You know, we've been yapping a little bit, but you guys are you guys yep. are the best supporters around. All right? Appreciate you guys, man. Uh, we got the pop-up cherry. We're going to be trying out next. Ooh. The grape was pretty good. It was pretty good. I'm, you know, I'm not... You know completely what? disappointed. I'm not disappointed, but I'm going to say there was not much flavor in that It guy. was definitely my least favorite of the three so far. I'm going to say the lemon was my least favorite. That's definitely the same. Oh, I don't know about this smell, bro. It's spooky. I don't know about it. But you know what I do know is? Oh, I'm not interested. I got a oh. bubbly cherry. Let me smell that. There's probably no smell in that at all, bro. Oh, yeah, there is. Smell that. I don't know. Maybe my nose is a little clogged up. I feel a little nasally, honestly. This cherry smells a lot better. People say that I talk kind of nasally and I'm trying to work on it, but you know. A nasal What can you do when you've been talking nasally your whole dang life? And then somebody tells you, you're like, fuck, okay. I'm trying to figure that out. 
Anyways. I'm kind of scared for this one. Whoa, what is it? What not scared, where did the bottle go? Do you have it? I have the bottle, yet. You know what I mean? I'm not going to lie, I've had a lot of juice spill in my car over the years, and it sucks. It's so gross, man. Oh, yeah, me too. So this is the cherry, I believe. Let's give it a go. Let's give it a go. Let's give it a try. Let's give it a Benjamin Smackington. Oh. Really? Oh. Are you surprised? Oh, it's like cherry um, cherry pop. I think that's why it's called pop-up. Everything is starting to make sense now. No. Are you serious? You <laughs> just got that now? Yeah. I'm not, not everyone's as smart as you, buddy. All right. I think I think three steps ahead, buddy. And sometimes you gotta figure stuff out while you're on the ride. You know what I mean? Like when I was on the wooden roller coaster and I figured out that drinking e-liquid is probably not good for your stomach. Yeah. But I did it so other people won't. You know, mm. people watching this video that were thinking about Tasting drinking it, it's like the forbidden, the it's like the forbidden coaster. fruit, man, like a Tide Pod or something. You know, people think about doing it all the time, but then like I don't know. Maybe I should wait to see if somebody else does it first and see what happens. And yeah, I give it a go and don't do it, man. I really wish I could make a, a video with Theo Vaughn. Really? I'd yeah. make a video with Colin Myers. Who's that? I don't know. He's a Twitch streamer, I think, maybe. I want to see clips of him. He seems mad chill. I would definitely blaze with him. If I was going to make a video with that guy, I'd make a dab pen video with him. Big shout outs to him. Go check him out if you haven't yet. If Anyways. I were to ever try cocaine, I would do with Theo Vaughn just so he could <laughs> scare the shit out of me. We got Bubble Gang Blue Raspberry. I'd probably just do it with a random guy in the alley. <laughs> <laughs> well... Take a sniff of this, guys. Yeah. Imagine if there's 4D videos. 4D. This is the blue raspberry. It smells insane, dude. Blue raspberry bubble gang. Oh, that. It's... Is that working? Oh, yeah. Is that working right now? I'm in Huffington Estate this Dude, time. my car is actually so mangled right now. All I've been doing is just using it for work, right? Like, it's True. a work vehicle. And it's probably been like two weeks since I've actually cleaned it. And it's just stacking up and stacking up. Like, Matt's standing on, like, 20 boxes right now. Of garbage. No, some of them actually have disposables in them, I'm pretty sure. Are you serious? Maybe. Nah, I made you no, look. It's all not. garbage. No. <laughs> made you look, though. I was gonna fucking steal one. So, uh, yeah, this is the blue raspberry. Uh, oh, really? Yeah. What is this? Mexican mango? Give that a try. Sweet. You can have it. I won't try it in this video, video just brother. to be fair. Oh, yeah, yeah, I meant, like, off camera. Yeah. But anyways, what is this blue raspberry? Oh, oh, that one had a little suction pop for the fruit at the beginning there. The best one. By far. Oh, dude, I can smell it. Oh, my gosh. It smells kind of like those things that, you remember when you had, like, a, like, a, a, a it was, like, a popsicle, kind of, but you could, like, have put the things on it? The, the, the. Juice, no juice, oh, yeah, 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 Juicy juicy drop pop, pop. yeah, 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 yeah. those are fire, bro. I like those back in the day, those were definitely a freaking OG hitter. I feel like I'm too old to buy one of those now, you know. I don't think they make them anymore. Oh, yeah, definitely best. I feel like if I bought one from like a 7 Eleven, I'd be like, oh, yeah, like it's for the kid, it's a fucking babysitting. (laughs) No, like my five year old son's at home, like he's gonna be, and then I'll just be like in the corner of the parking lot, like. (laughs) <laughs> just sucking on a juicy pot. <laughs> it's a pretty sus candy to be sucking on. Especially when I you're a 23-year-old man. Yep. Anyways. <laughs> yep. Back to Bubble Gang. We got the Bubble Gang Watermelon. Now, so far, what do you think of the Mr. Foggy liquids? I know it's your first I time like trying the them. the Bubble Gang well. better than the Pop-Up. That's okay. I will say. That's fine. Yeah. That's totally fine, dude. I like them equally as good, I think. Really? Yeah. I really like the art. They're always good at art, Mr. Fogg. They are. They are. They have good art. Maybe they could have centered it a little, maybe, but can't complain, right? It's all part of the, um, the scheme. The swag. Yeah. Oh. And if they were 50, that'd be oh, nice, but oh. that's just... Watermelon bubblegum might be the best hitter, bro. Mm, I got high fuck. hope for that one. It smells like Very fucking... high hope. It smells like Big League Chew. So have you seriously not watched... Um, Three body problem. I have not. Take a guess about what it would be about. A person with three bodies and it's a problem. <laughs> that's, what I, that's what I want you to think, buddy. <laughs> it's, it's a lot bigger deal than that. Three body problem. I don't even know. I don't even know what that could be about. You actually should watch it. It's crazy. If you're into like sci-fi type type beat, you know? Yeah, yeah. I don't know why I can't stop thinking about it, but I got like really stoned last night and watched it, dude. 
My God, I was actually at like, you know, have you, you ever get really, I know you used to smoke. I, I tried to look up the fucking thing and it just, it, this is what it says. A, a learned educator delivers a lecture shedding light on a three body problem in a detailed and easy to understand manner. They don't like to give you too much. <laughs> like, I don't they know. Don't what like is that even supposed much. to mean? But I know that you used to smoke, so I feel like you can relate to this. You ever you ever get really baked and you like find a new TV show, but you're just like locked in, buddy? That was new Supernatural, like actually, like, bro. Fucking locked, dude. That's like, how long ago that I used to smoke weed. Supernatural was the show that I got fucking absolutely locked in on. But you feel like you're there show. almost. Oh, you know yeah, what I mean? You dude. fly all the wall. Yeah, me, Dean, and Sam, we would fucking ho- hunt, hunt ghosts. As sad as this sounds, bro, when I'm not smoking, TV don't hit the same. It's you're, hard for me to like dial in on it, you know. I'm pretty sure focus. somebody who watches our videos is actually uh, was in Supernatural. Tyler Simpkins. I don't know if he watches every single one, but if you are, what's up, buddy? What's up, Tyler? Watermelon. I don't think we tried it yet. Last flavor. I hope you guys are enjoying today's video so far. If you guys are, make sure to drop a thumbs up. If you guys want to see more videos like this, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn the post notification bell on so you don't miss a single notification. Um, he was yeah. also in Insidious. One He's the main the character in all the Insidiouses. That's insane. I yeah. didn't even know that. Yeah. So shout out Tyler. And Jurassic Park, actually. He was in Jurassic World or whatever. But damn. Bro. He was in a lot. Bro, 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 bro. That's it. That's the one. This is the hitter? That one's better than Blue Raspberry. I'm glad we saved that one for last. That was not intentional at all, but dude. What do you think? I think you a little bit. I think you gassed it up a little bit. I like it a lot. I think this is what you I like would honestly do. Better? I would do Blue Raz first. Second one would be the other bubble gum, bubble gang. Then there would be the grape pop-up. Oh, so you like the strawberry better. I like the strawberry better, yeah. Dang. That just goes to show. Matt and I, we have different palettes. He's more of a Remember fry guy. I'm that. more of a chicken tendy guy. You know what I'm saying? I am a fry guy. But uh, yeah, I think we're going to end the video off here. Obviously, we ain't going to forget the community hit. So feel free to use the Mexican mango. I'll use this guy. Rat beat. Uh, I mean, uh, chillin' bro. I mean, Rubat. Rubat. Shout out Rubat. All right, we're going to do the community hit here, guys. If you guys are participating in the community hit today, make sure to comment 1710 because that is the timestamp that we're at in today's video. If you guys do comment that, I really appreciate it. Uh, question of the day, I'll leave it up to Matt because I didn't even think of one. I didn't think of one either, but question of the day. Um, I like to put people on the spot. It's one of my favorite things to do. Um, iPhone or Android? Oh, that's a good question. I'm, like? I'm on team iPhone. I'm on team iPhone too. Okay, cheers, buddy. Cheers. Oh, yeah, one at a time. Okay, he goes, then I go, and then you go. And uh, yeah, that's about it, guys. Hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. Peace. Peace. Hopefully the weather's good where you guys are at. Probably isn't, especially if you're in Ontario. Boom. <laughs>